Alright guys, welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. Uh, I'm a bit thirsty, so just give me a sec here. Okay, good shit. Uh, we're gonna go... Let's do... Okay, so you have a choice between... Uh, Sawmill or Paradise Downs. I actually like Paradise Downs. That fight looked actually really cool. Let's go there. Didn't you just say last episode you are gonna do the Sawmill? I fucking did not say anything. I, said, I just listed out all the things that we needed to do. Pussy piece of shit. I will fucking... Uh, Fight in IRL. Yeah. Alright. Let's go back to where we were before. Red Prince will gloriously fly to victory. Hey. Hey. Let me bring Sabiel over here. All right, so this was what we thought was a fight, and that thing, it's the Harbinger of Doom. He's also a fat motherfucker, so that also helps. So, I mean, I'm sure Sibiel will just kind of tactical fucking leap into his ass and then kill him. Oh, we actually didn't loot all these buddies, either. Who was you afraid of starting the fight? Well, I'm kind of, can see why, because fucking, he just has an eye, raw gimplets, and intestines. Good shit. Look at the swordsman. Alright, well, let me just save it because we are going to trigger a fight. Nah, there's nothing on him. Uh, I mean, how do we want to start this fight? <laughs> let me examine this guy. What does he Let's have? Let's look for high ground. Look, look for high ground first we can go to. Alright. Ah, uh, there's high ground. Uh, where, where are you pinging? Over there somewhere? Yeah, and let's look at this high ground over here that you can get to. Like, it's like climbable surfaces, I mean. I don't know if it's the two towers as well. The two towers? That was my favorite Lord of the Rings movie. Okay, let me just disconnect uh, Sibiel and thing, because she likes to do things. Like, if you can get up there, that's probably pretty good. I am already up here. I'm actually going to bring, um, I'm going to go up there as well. You have the yellow one on you? Oh, yeah. you have the green one. I mean, the only, the, thing, the only thing I'm kind of afraid of is, like, can he just teleport us down or some shit? I mean, I, fuck, I could, I, I, like, I could just start trying to bombard him. How, how would he get up here? I think he'd fly here, wouldn't he? Probably. Do you want me to leave Beast up here, just in case? I don't know, I don't give a fuck. I was gonna bring him down, but... No, no, get, stop no. that event! Get back up there! Alright, I'm ready for combat. Is there anything interesting over here anyways? Not really. I mean, mushrooms. Yeah, 420. Okay, uh, I'm going to fucking... I'm gonna shoot this guy, you ready to go? I'll have Beast chill back here, but yeah, it's... Make right. a blood surface for me. I'll make a blood surface. Oh, he's, uh, not happy. <laughs> Look at that! Oh, hey! Harbinger's Wrath? That motherfucker. Uh, no. Hurt. I need death resist. I give you magic on this, do What the fuck is this, like, five turn bullshit? Oh my god, he gets another hit on top of that? You f that's an ability he used already, what the fuck? Alright, well. Fire immunity aura. Alright, you need to bring Sibyl back to life. Or, or I will, either one. I mean, I was hoping you would do it and then I'd just death resist her, and obviously this motherfucker is here. Alright. Make sure you don't use any fire spells. Yeah. Because, <laughs> you know, we totally do that all the time. So, I'm thinking I'm going to res the beal right next to the... Because yes. I know you want to do this guy. Of course you know what I want to do this guy. I mean, d just do it. I, I don't know what my range on death resist is, actually. I think it's like point blank, but... I mean, yeah, just just put... Actually, just put me right in the middle of them. Like, put Seville right in the middle. And then, because it's it's Red Prince's turn next, I'll just death resist her. It's fine. She she won't die. I mean, I could tell I could put right next to the Harbinger of Doom. We could just try and blow him up. I mean, that's what we're going to do. But I need to heal back. Yeah, I was gonna do that and put tell like put her here right next to him. Put put her put her here, because then she can get death resisted and maybe absorb some hits. Like she'll just tactical jump. I'm I'm sure he's gonna move around. Sure, I'll put him right like right there. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. This is what death resist is for. For making stupid decisions. 
I had two points left to fuck around with this. I should probably give my Incarnate Power Infusion. Yeah. Given that they're free dudes to kill. Thanks, Brohan. And I have a point left. I can give someone Magic Armor. I mean, no, I think Encourage is the play. That's yeah, Encourage. Just give us all the extra edge and health. Okay, where's Death Resist? Death Resist. Uh, living on the edge. On Sabeel. Actually, that, that, that shit does have range. Alright. Now heroes will never die. Uh, well, I got nothing else to do here. Um, I guess I'll do bullhorns and... Maybe I should do, like, should I do spider legs maybe or something? Just maybe entangle them. Yeah, I'll get, I'll get, have the option to entangle them next turn. Okay, I can start DPSing the big guy, or I can start working with these guys. Yeah. Like, what do you want to focus here? Uh, it's up to you. I would I would f focus on CCing them, maybe. This is why the spider legs is actually really nice. But, I don't know. It's up to you. I don't know what's going to happen to these guys when we kill the Harbinger of Doom, so maybe bringing him down would be good. I can well win them. Oh. And get yeah. all of them. And Sabiel gets a turn before, <laughs> for, uh, before anybody else. That's good. She gets like two turns too. Alright. Poison them. Heal them a little bit, but it's fine. Oh wait, Sabiel isn't decaying right now. I mean, I'm not sure why that is actually. I think it's I think I'll just take effect next turn. So I can't knock them down this turn. Because Sabiel's in the way. Oh. So I'm still gonna take a pot shot at the Whose fucking idea was it to put her there? Take a pot shot at the big guy. Yeah, just do that. What the fuck? What's that gonna do? Oh, it just. <laughs> yeah, like I have to give a fuck. <laughs> Shackles of pain. I can knock all of them down, actually. Yeah, uh, go ahead. We're gonna have to blow up that guy next, by the way. <laughs> If he doesn't die when uh, the, the big ass guy dies. Actually, what if there's some bullshit where I can get. Actually, actually the she could break out of Doom. Thing. What? Uh, sorry, I was talking to myself. What? Bullshit way of. Uh, <clears> I mean, <throat> I'm pretty sure she's gonna kill him. Let me check if the let me check if he's immune to knockdown first. I mean, he's not he, immune to knockdown. He's a big guy. For you. Yeah. He's immune to fire? Oh. Shucks. Okay, I think I am gonna. Use a movement point to scoot forward a bit so I can get this bit better. Because if it gets worth it, try and get him in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another another moment where the pawn would have been really useful. Eat shit. You'll get it one day. One day. <laughs> Maybe you'll get the pawn, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. It just will not reach him. It's like, it's just so close. Shit, pick all you want, motherfucker. But yeah, if Samuel can break out of Shackles of Pain, I forgot about that. She actually, I think she gets it for free too. Aha! I got him. Yeah, it's free. It's free. What the fuck, dude? Is this gonna fuck me up now? Cause now he's like on the ground. Did you just make us lose? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> well, you can spend your turn buffing, and then the next turn you can do the arrow spray. For worst case, cause you'll get up because he gets a turn. That's true, but. And then take five turns and <laughs> kill everyone. Ah. <laughs> uh. Well, he'll spend his turn getting up, so maybe, maybe that maybe that. So I can play. fortify Sabeel, and it won't do anything, right? I, I mean... Actually, fuck it! You know what, we're don't all even here. bother. No, it's like, we're all close to this is time for this. Alright. Like, if you think it's gonna fuck you up, don't yeah, do it. Yeah, fuck Just wait that. Next turn. <laughs> so fucking dumb what you've done here. Hate you forever. Just do it next turn! I fucking hate you anyways. I hate you. Like, I doubt you're gonna kill him with that fucking ray. Well, not with that attitude, I won't. Bitch. <laughs> List All right, of get Alright. What the fuck is this fucking angle? Dude, I, I think we lost, actually. Alright. You can always scoot around a bit if you need to. I, I can't... I th oh, yeah, I think they're all gonna hit him, actually. Okay, good. Thank God for this fucking UI. It's so nice, actually. Yeah, he's oh my dead. god, you did almost kill him. <laughs> <laughs> if 
fact with the uh, adrenaline. Yeah. Eat shit, Papa Drip, dude. We can take 12 turns as well. <laughs> Alright. Woo! All right, get, get, didn't get rid of the rest of them, so let me just break shackles. Yeah, no one cares. Alright, um. Wait, what the hell? Everything. Nothing's decaying anymore. Yeah, it's nice here now. Oh. This is a fucking easy fight. Sweet. Low ground. Oh, I got damage coming too. Oh well. Glorious. Yeah, mine. damage penalties through 600 damage. Alright, sweet. This is easy now. I'm like just chilling out with the Harbinger of Doom over here. So this is literally just a fight in like the corner here or whatever. Yeah, Harbinger of Doom doing what he does. I mean, she, she... They're all firing me, but Wait, do we care? How is Sabeel full health already? She leveled up. Oh, yeah. Uh, the, oh, okay. So we used the fucking... Path of Exile rules. I see. Yeah, yeah, of course. So do we care um, about what? What do we care about? Like the fire is a store. Like, do we give a shit? I don't no. think we do. No, I don't, that, was, that was a joke. I have to actually go in my backpack and use fire things. Like, Red Prince has a fire ability, but when have you ever seen me use it on a serious level? Like, never. Hey, bitch, you're standing. Get on the ground now. <laughs> Alright, I, I guess I'll... Uh, I don't know. I'll save my point, actually. I was thinking, like, I could haste someone, but, like, no, it's no point. Roll in melee range. I probably, for the future, should death resist Sevilla when she opens up a fight like that, to be honest. Because they seem to like to, to kill her. It's a pretty good skill to have. E either that or we need to like give her like something else. I don't know, death resist would probably work. I could reactive armor. That would suck. I'm not gonna do that. Mm. I'll just bull horns and wait, I guess. Oh, Actually, do you want do you want enrage on your boy? Nah, I I'd rather use my abilities, I think. Oh no, it's this person. Fire me, dude. Wait, I made them bleed, but they're skeletons! <laughs> Are they skeletons? I thought they were zombies. No, yeah, they're zombies. They're undead. Fair enough. So you can make them bleed, yes. Bleeding block by physical. It's two bleeding here. Uh, let's use this one. Uh, Sabiel can't really do anything, because she doesn't have any armor anyways. Is she still Invis? No, she's not Invis anymore. Why? Because she got blood on. Did she? Um, uh, not the rain. The rain isn't going near uh, her. Uh, no, she's poisoned, that's why. Oh, really? Uh. She took damage. So it was the one-off when it ticked her turn. <laughs> oh shit, I almost killed that guy. <laughs> We just steal the kill. Yeah, no, I'm good with that. Trust me. He, that was the guy who wanted to shackles with pain me. I think. So I figured I'd make them bleed, but I guess that was a waste of fucking time because it was like, I, I figured that one of them would like take damage or something. I don't know. These guys are dumb. But they're level 14. The, the the main difficult thing was the Harbinger of Doom, who blew up Sveil. Which, to be fair, turn. did kill someone. <laughs> I mean, he did. Like I said, he, he fucking teleported and used like fucking four abilities. Like, how do I know he's supposed to fucking open up the fight like that? It's fucking bullshit. Run away! <laughs> Arg. <laughs> Go get him. Make his problem. I don't know what to do. I guess I can... No, actually, I'm Quick. gonna chase him down. Fuck this. Wait, well, how about the guy next to you? <laughs> yeah, fuck that. I'll just fly over no, to him with my prince. It'll be fine. I know I have spider legs. It'll be fine. I'll, I'll haste. I'll I'll I'll, I'll stay. Because I'm not gonna kill this guy. Oh, maybe I am actually. Yeah, you are gonna kill him. I was underestimated his damage just a little bit. Fuck. I don't know what to do here. This nice damage, my dude. Fine, I'm gonna fucking turn him into chicken, bitch. Yeah, draw this out. 
I mean, I'm not drawing it out. Okay, well, Sabeel has one turn left in Tactical Retreat, but I could just walk up there and shoot him. I, I don't hey. know what to do. Hollow's buried viables over there. Yeah. Fuck, target is out of sight. You know, fuck this shit. He's going to die next turn. Button. So, so what? Where's the? Oh yeah, you're right. There, are, there are valuables here. Worth. I'm actually looking around like, hey, it's actually this place isn't shit anymore. It was worth, worth, worth. Okay, it's fucking incarnate. I, I hasted you. <laughs> like I'm trying to like move anywhere. It's like no, I that's too far away, boss. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, fuck it. I'm just gonna accept that I have to move up. Move that gear up. Who's gonna get all the glory? Oh, that's bad. Don't touch that sentry. Ah, oh, shit. You almost got him. Yeah, if only I'd be able to attack from the high ground. It's fine. N another swap, uh, another swap someone. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> the fuck are you doing, bitch? I'm glad you took damage. You know exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> Long live the king! <laughs> no, Seville's gonna fucking finish it. Now you really are prolonging the fight, you fuck. <laughs> Long live the king! <laughs> God, do I even count as being in combat anymore? <laughs> <laughs> Later, dude. He fucking finishes shit, honestly. <laughs> promise. You, you just spent your entire turn prolonging this stupid shit. You just fucking kill it. I don't want to be in this fight anymore. <laughs> you are in the fight anymore. Yeah, you're right. I'm, not, I'm actually not. I need the experience. <laughs> okay, go and get back in the fight before I kill this dude. Fuck, how do I even get up here? Oh, it's... Okay, what, what the fuck? That kind of just... Actually, I won't even kill him. Because it's fucked up. Okay, go. Go, go. go get him. Yeah, yeah, I won't kill him. Like, it's... Well, the poison might get him, actually. Wow, yeah, fucking... We could have ended it earlier, but now... Now I get to fucking just, you know... You know what? You don't get the glory of the kill. I get the glory of being <laughs> drunk. <laughs> <laughs> fucking... <laughs> you, you know what? You know what it's time for? Fucking... It's time to... Where is it? You know what would really help in the situation? If I use that planet gate thing. Stargates. To find, I'm trying to find some, a, a nice thing to put down. Where is it? Okay. I'm gonna go admire some art. Is it a middle finger? Yeah. <laughs> you gonna put a portrait down? <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? I killed it. I killed the portrait. <laughs> man, don't hurt me for this. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna kill valuables. This is what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Every turn this guy lives, he just dumps it on the ground and destroy it. Look, he died. Yeah, how did he die? <laughs> poison. He had to get poisoned to death. I wasn't done yet. He's <laughs> gonna get a bunch Wait, of- Wait, how do you get poisoned to death? He's an undead. Oh, whatever. <laughs> whatever. I'm just- I'm gonna now- for now on, I'm gonna have a bunch of valuables on me, and every time you fucking do that, I'm just gonna destroy <laughs> the valuables in the corner. <laughs> Sounds like a good deal. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I got a good one-handed axe here. It's actually really nice. Alright, just for you, I'm gonna put a point in Scoundrel. Ethan, Strong get Will, Warfare, and Scoundrel. That's a uh, pretty good ring, actually. Let me give that to Beast, actually. And Healing Ritual Skill Book for Ethan and Large Thunder Rune. Alright, that was a pretty good haul. I get a point in Scoundrel on Ethan as well, maybe. And then get like uh, the pawn on him as well. Just a, a point of free movement sounds good every time. Okay, there's no ghost here that like I'm not seeing again, right? <laughs> I like you're paranoid now. I, I, well, what do you think? Okay, how much, how many source points is the Harbinger of Doom worth? Just one. Okay. I'm Man, slightly, slightly game disappointed. Sucks. Alright, and the loot. I guess the dead magister is here. 
Uh, did you loot the, what does the harbinger have on him? Uh, I gave it to, gave Beast and you some stuff. Okay, I'll look around. There's some skill books and some armor and some other shit. Uh, Warthorn Scoundrel. Eh, maybe be something like that. Alright, how do we get over there? Guess I'll just fly like a beautiful butterfly. No, I'll stop doing my beast. Oh, no, we can just jump down. A corpse. Neat. Wait, there's a lot of people here. Stranded merchant, the fuck? Oh shit. It's a it's a rug neck. Having a good party? Right, are you? Smart. I'm talking to people. I've got my whole life in these wagons. Look at me. Like a fly in molasses. What has this caravan stranded? You didn't see it. Something happened up ahead. Blocked off the only road to arcs. Lest you fancy taking a stroll through the death fog. We're proper wrecked. What can we do to help? Not unless you can bring back the divine. He done twist this pretzel in a heartbeat, no doubt. Hey, he's actually selling a lot of things here. Pyroclastic eruption. Okay. It's just, that has pyro in it, so I don't want it. Aerospray, spider legs, force exchange. Epo hypothesis. Take the first step towards god godhood. The cost of all source skills is modified by three source points. What? Three memory slots? The fuck? So what does it mean by th modified by three source points? Maybe it means that like if you cast it with more source available, it'll do more? It costs Maybe. three source points to begin with. I don't know. Silencing stare. Silence enemies in a cone in front of you. Living on the edge. We already know. It's weird. I, I want to look up that one later. Destroy an allied summon or totem. Oh, cannibalize would be really good for you. That's actually amazing. You can do, you can instantly destroy summons. I, I remember using enemy that. summons or mine en en enemy summons. Receive huh. half of their vitality, physical armor, and magic armor for yourself. That sounds good. Yeah, I mean you could do it on your. Oh no no no! Sorry, it is allied. My bad. Sorry, but it's still really good though. It's still really good. I, I thought it was enemy. Add glitter dust. Target is marked, decreasing their ability to dodge. Prevents tar mark target from going invisible. Alright, that might be also pretty good for me. I'm just, sorry, I'm just looking at all this. Farsight. Increase the range of target characters, range attacks, and skills by 3 meters. Eh, that doesn't seem that good. Especially since it costs a, a source point. Yep. <laughs> I found the Stargate ability. <laughs> That's so good, dude. Uh, challenge skill book. Mark a target. If they die in the next 3 turns, you are healed and receive d damage and armor bonus. If the target survives, their vitality is healed to full, and the caster receives damage. Well, I'm pretty sure that would be a good one for us. Uh, that might be good for me. I put death resist on, I fucking just go in and like tank a bunch of damage, and I'm like, alright, challenge that guy, we kill that guy, and that's it. Blitz that's attack. your plan, boss. Yeah, uh, overpower skill book. Yeah, well, I also need to put my levels in, but I'm looking at this stuff. I'm sure you'll get a chance to look at this. Uh, Actually, while you're doing this, I'm going to look at town, because they might have new stuff to sell. This guy has Resurrection Scroll 7. He also has a, a bunch of other kinds of scrolls. You should buy a lot of those, actually. Tornado would might be actually really good. Removing surfaces and revealing invisible characters, but uh, if you get, like, Tornado Scrolls, that would also be really good. Reactive Armor. Deal... Oh, that's the... Wait. What the fuck? Reactive armor? Have you ever looked at that? Deal de physical damage based upon your current physical armor in a wave of metal spikes to everyone in the area, including yourself. Geomancer 2. Yep. Is that the one you have? That's what I've been using. You put points of Geomancer for that, then? Yeah. Uh, I see. That's, that's what you start as, as a tank character. You get Geomancy and Warfare. I did Warfare uh, first. I see. And I have Geomancy 5, just so I have the base for it. Okay. To get all the skills. Alright, I think I'm pretty much done with this. That, uh, that hypothesis ability is interesting. Oh, there's also one of the invisibility mushrooms. I'm gonna actually look at what this does, actually. Because this, this 
thing is not very uh, descriptive. And what it does. I'm now very curious about that. Uh, hypothesis. Also, the cost of all source skills is reduced by three source points. That is really good, actually. But requires three right. memory. So what, yeah. what you can do is, because it, it sets it for two turns, so you can basically, like, um, just stack a bunch of really powerful skills that require, like, I have that thing, that skin graph that resets all the cooldowns. I have, and it, oh, it can only be used once per combat. That's how good it is. Fucking hell. Uh, that's tough, man. I don't think I want that yet, man. Because I, I have too much to do here. Also, I have to... Okay, um, yeah, by the way. By the way. Town has got new spells. Town has got new spells. So, I have... Actually, you could probably just look at this yourself, really, because it would be easier. But there is Glitter Dust here. Uh, Arrow Storm. And Assassinate for Sabeel. Those are all Huntsman stuff. Assassinate, what does that do? Attack a target with meticulous aim, dealing weapon damage in one shot. While performed, when performed from stealth, this attack gets 50% damage increase. So you can set the give, that, give that to me right now, you motherfucker. Alright, I'll just buy it. I know you want that. No, I do want that. That's actually... Because she, okay. she, she stealths all the time, actually. Like, that alone for opening fights? Like, yeah, like... Yeah, that fucking is amazing. Blitz attack. Okay. Actually, I think it's double weapon damage, because I think that's like... Yeah, it's like double... Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. So we put on two new skills. Takes three points to cast, but, you know, if you're doing that from opening fights, yeah, no, no, it's cause, amazing. Because you know how, like, I buff myself at the beginning of my turn, I delay my turn for the next one, and then I basically have 12 AP points to use. Like, I, I've done that, like, twice. I don't, I don't do it enough, admittedly, but, yeah. Okay, another thing, Arrow Storm. Okay. Takes three source points to use, takes three action points, and it's the AoE. Remember that from the first, first game? Okay, that also might be really good. Ring, don't I mean, it's expensive, but fuck it, you know. I mean, do, do, we, really have, do we really have money issues? Yeah, Not really, I got 3,000. I mean, this is, like, this is already costing 8,000 with two skill books, but whatever. <laughs> uh, like, this is, what, this is what the money's for, right? And did you want glitter, glitter dust? Glitter dust? Uh, I... I mean, it could be good utility, but I'm not sure, actually, about that. I mean, might as well, I guess. Is it expensive? Oh, it's, like, 2,500 gold. 2,500. I mean, that's not a lot. Here, I'll, I'll just give you all the red princes money. I don't give a fuck. There you go. E-fan. There you are. Oh, yeah, that, that definitely covers it. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Challenge? You want to challenge as well? Uh, challenges. Oh, yeah, that one. That one might be really good for both of us. I found something. Well, I, can buy the, I can buy the one from the merchant over there as well. Yeah, Get that works. Alright. I just got... Oh, global cooling? Oh, shit. Dude, dude, global warming is a myth. It's all about global cooling. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Overpower. I want that. Over what? What do you want? Uh, Guardian Angel. I also want that for Beast. Overpower, but the thing is, if, if your physical armor is higher than your opponent's, you destroy all <laughs> their physical armor. Yeah, yeah, that was, I, I remember that being one of the ones. I just sent a book to Efan, and I'll send more gold to Efan, too. Okay, we're getting thought skill book. I can sell that. Okay, so all of a sudden we're fucking cool. like we're getting so much shit right now. I'll sell that book. I guess it goes to the purging one, but no, I'll keep it. Why not? Sure. If we wanted to get eaten by a bleeding boy, Uh, how much health does Red Prince have? That much. Oh, it's really not that big of a difference, but oh well. Alright, I'm gonna send a wristband to you. Alright. Well, I've pretty much leveled these guys up, so you just send me whatever. I'll just. I'm gonna talk to some of the characters here. Yeah, cool. Don't worry about it. You stand, stunned. Before you, as if she stepped out of a dream, she awaits. The woman you've dreamt of since birth. The Red Princess. I, I have met the Red Princess. Uh, introduce yourself as a red prince and ask if she's as honored as you are. You do not disappoint, my prince. You're every bit the royal they said you'd be. How very pleasurable is it not to finally meet in the flesh? For it is very much in the flesh that we must meet, after all. Become one. 
Why are you overburdened? <laughs> oh, because it's stuff okay. Have you got a moment? Uh, it's actually a sword here. Uh, sure. Um, it costs 3,600 gold, but it does 100 to 111 physical damage, 20 to 23 earth, plus one two-handed skill, and plus 10% life steal. Uh, I mean, I think mine's really good. I, I, I can't look at it right now. Yeah, if yours is really good, then I won't bother. Yeah, mine is like, mine like... has twenty percent crit chance and cleave and shit, man. I, I, I'm t I'm taking this one. Okay, okay. So what? Give me the option. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm talking to fucking the lizard sluts. So one sec. Oh, father, life shaper. That is what the goddess called you. How good of you, dear prince, that you have come to shape life in me. Uh. Got a second. <laughs> yes, dear. Um. Silent Violence, Crossbow, 103 physical damage, 207 physical damage, yes. 21 to 21 air, plus 3 finesse, plus 200 free health. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. How much is that? Like, 6,000, but you know, that's what covered, that's covered yeah, by the one you gave me, so that's fine. Fucking huge amount of fucking... Yeah, but like, I knew that was worth, like, giving you, like, <laughs> hey, do you want this? Yeah, yeah it is. Um... It's from... Uh, Smile and say to hold your horses you only just met. Oh, don't be coy. We're not strangers, you and I. There's no one in this world I know better than you. You are the secret of my soul, just like I am yours. Softly, she moves her body against yours, puts her arms around your neck, her mouth hot against your ear. Let's forget for a moment all the forces that drove us here, shall we? Let us think of nothing but ourselves, one amid a nest of satin. You and I, we know each other like only true lovers do. So at long last, let us become lovers. You're in, she's right, it's time to become lovers. Her endearing smile just about melts your heart. Wonderful. Come, let's retire to that satin nest of mine. Follow me. Uh oh. The interior of the wagon is like a world unto itself, a slice of home all too far away. The scent of incense abounds as the Red Princess reclines luxuriously upon large pillows embroidered with mythical scenes. I feel some demonetization coming. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> uh, so amid all the hustle and bustle, you forgot to ask her name. My name is Sada. I thought you knew. Shake your head. You didn't know, but you're glad. But you're glad you asked. You're sweet. You know that. Uh, point to one of the pillows and say that it has pic pic pictures of Visha, the famed hero and lover. Twas when he came to Oram and slew the seven-headed snake, and seven wives they brought him, for him to leave or take. I was never very fond of that verse, actually. But tell me, how would you like to be remembered, as a hero or a lover? There's no doubt in your mind as a hero and a king. The expected answer. Which does not, I hasten to say, make it a disappointing one. So very few of us understand the true nature of ambition, of power. You are ambition and power. Of course, you're not the only one. <laughs> Fuck it out. Uh, sporting a roguish smile, grab the front of her dress dress and tear it open. The velvet fabric easily tears, <laughs> exposing her bare shoulders and breasts. Oh boy. <laughs> oh my, that dress could have paid a prince's ransom, you know. Uh, Jesus Christ, I don't want to read this stuff. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fucking hell, dude. Uh, uh Fucking... Uh, whatever this one says, you guys can fucking read it. She places one hand on your head, you lost? encouraging your kisses, and as she does so, the other slides down in between your legs. I don't know who's home. Someone could be like outside my door. <laughs> Let's do this shit. A whisper and a moan. Undress. Yeah, sure. You remove your clothes. She removes hers, and soon you're in each other's arms again, naked. How un. Bearably beautiful it is, having to dream no longer. Make love to me, my prince. Uh. Smile, point close, sure. 
You embrace, and at long last, you become one, the Red Prince and the Red Princess, accompanying eons in the making, and as world-moving as it is quietly intimate, here, in a lone wagon, in a lone spot, in Rivelon vast and fair. Peace, true peace. There's never been a moment such as this, the cuddling after, in this little satin nest. Hours pass, sweet talk, sweet touches. She's asleep now in your arms. What do you do? You stay, of course. Sleep with her. There's nothing out there finer than this. Several hours later, you awaken with her lips on yours. Time to wake, sweet prince, and return to the mundanity of dreams once more. You dress and cast a loving glance over her body, still soft with sleep. Daylight bemists your eyes as you descend the wagon's steps, hand in hand. As you exit the wagon, you're awaited by a vile-looking lizard. His face, the very definition of mischief. Oh, shit. Well, well, well. Look who's coming up for air. Mighty powerful noises I heard coming from that there carriage. Teensy bit jealous I am. I think I just cucked someone. <laughs> What's going on here? Demand he identify himself. Ignoring you completely, he laughs wickedly and addresses Sada. My, oh my, you didn't tell lover boy anything, did you, dollface? Naughty, naughty. Ask Sado what's going on. I, I am sworn. To another. That's right, little prince. Your boo is betrothed to a very different kind of king. All she needed from you was a dollop of prophecy juice. I dare say she got it. You utter villain. Ah... Uh... Ah. Uh. <laughs> you could have brutally mad murdered this man first. Uh, uh, I don't know if I want to kill this guy. Turn to sit and say you don't care what's going on. You love her. I love you too. I swear it. Together we will brave it all. Even the king. Oh, ain't that as sweet as a bowl full of peaches? I hate to be this guy, but I gotta break up the party now. Time for you and your belly full of litter to crawl back to the king, darling. Gonna get me some private time with Prince Charming myself. He grins widely, revealing rows of blackened teeth. I've always had a soft spot for red meat. Hey, I'm about to fight, so... Okay, well, I... Check your shit first. Okay. 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 That seems kind of good. Alright. That's a nice bow, and it even has a slot on it, but I don't have anything to put in the slot, I think. You have a large rune. Uh, oh, you gave me a large rune, I think. I'll yeah, pass it back. Yeah, I did. No, no, don't don't worry about it. I'll just fucking put on some other kind of damage. It's fine. It doesn't matter to me. I have fucking fire damage, sure, why not? Well, we'll find more runes, I'm sure. That's some nice shit, though. I'm not even done over here. <laughs> but we need to fight. Assassinate. Tar attack target with meticulous aim... Doing dealing damage in one shot. When performed it from stealth, this attack gains a 50% damage increase. Fuck yeah. Maybe the sniper voice wanted to be Arrow Storm. 16 arrows fall from the sky in the target area, each dealing physical damage. Fucking hell. Tornado skill book. Alright. Better dust is marking a target, preventing him from going invisible. Alright, so. <clears throat> I probably should start, like, having two things for this. Alright, I, I don't think I'm gonna use- oh my god, Aerostorm requires that many points. <laughs> uh, yeah. I just wanna see how this works, actually. Okay. Explode radius. Alright, I get it, it's an AoE thing. But I guess we'll- well, I guess we'll use it some other level, we'll- we'll wait on that. Laser ray? Man. Uh, because I really like Glitter Dust. I, I mostly like the assassinate ability. Mark's been huh. saying. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, yeah, ooh, ooh. I want this. Dude, Equalize. Dude, I'm trying to, I'm trying to fucking kill the guy who just, like, I cucked or something. I don't know. The, the, the politics is right, I'll finish this one shopping, I'll come over then. I won't, I won't get, I won't look for my new stuff or anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Better not fucker. Equalize, like, redistributes health amongst, like, targets. 
Right. Flay skin. Okay, well, I can't learn challenge right now. What can you oh, doing? nullifies resistances. Okay, I'm coming over now. Like, you did this while I was like, yeah, I'm gonna go shopping. Well, I didn't know I was gonna just go, like, bang fucking hot lizard fucking bitches. I don't know. Dude. So, uh, apparently, uh, he, he's, he's stealing my, my DNA or something or whatever. I don't know what the fuck. Give me a second to learn my skills now. Won't be long. I, I just need a power, so I need. These guys are level 14. We're gonna wreck them. Okay, let me just put this. Let, let me put overpower on. Oh, I'm gonna overpower you. Fucking, I'm gonna overpower you, bitch. Um, fucking, I never use hard of steel. I'll take that off. Uh, I never use provoke really, and just never use it. It's never good. Oh god, overpower takes three memory slots. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, I know. Uh, I've, I've been actually putting some fucking points of memory actually. <laughs> you know, I never use bless. I'm taking that out. There we go. I have that on now. Alright. Okay, I'm gonna start the fight. Actually, let me, let me cloak myself. Oh, what the fuck? Why does everyone want to fight us here? Oh, I, I probably should have saved it. It's timing. Oh, nice. He missed me. Uh, so where's the person that I was with? I guess she ran into the fucking thing. What? That was like a thing where I fought that guy I left. I went to. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna delay my turn. Uh, there's no battle music, I see. Okay, so, I mean, they're gonna zerg us, I guess. Because there's a lot of level 14 guys. Oh, that guy has no physical armor. Why does the ancient guard always want to fuck me up, man? Juggernaut, bitch! Oh man, I can't. Damn. Damn? I was gonna do a thing, but I can't do the thing. Oh, okay. You lost. I was gonna encourage, but it doesn't work. <laughs> Rather, it's not worth. Quickly, discourage us. <laughs> it's all hopeless. I just like, can't move, so I guess let's turn him up. I still... uh, this might be bad. I don't want to do that. Actually, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna not put a turn next to Sabil. I mean, whatever. Fine. Because like they might attack it and splash, and you'd be mad at me, and I get chain pinged. I'll, I'll, I'll get mad at you for anything. I'll yield to none. You want haste and red prince? Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> I don't really mind if I fortify myself, because, you know. Eh. Uh, reasons. Damn, you get a lot of, like, maximum <laughs> physical armor. Why is there no music at all? What happened to the music? I don't know. Put some, put some own music in. Uh. XCOM inter interceptor music. Da 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 oh. da da da. da. Oh, oh, baby, oh, baby, oh, baby, oh, baby. Can I do this? Uh. I thought you were just really oh, into XCOM so Interceptor close. music. No, dude, dude, I can do this! What are you gonna do? Oh, this. This is better work. Alright, hang on. Wait, no, 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 no. How much does it take? How much does it take? Hang on. Hang on. Wait, I, I, I'm so excited! What are you fucking so excited for? Fuck. Overpower. Oh, it takes two. I can do this! Dude, this guy is so dead! Alright, guys, let me do this. All right, we're gonna watch. Uh, I don't want to waste. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna make sure that it's like, confirm my, it with that. My finger is on the shame ping button, by the way. I want to overpower this motherfucker. You want to take me on in a manly duel? You don't have enough armor. I have so much armor. Rip. Uh, okay. It just removes all his armor. That's all it does. Turn for butt. Yeah, nice try. That's what it does. You just remove like 2,000 armor from. Him. Oh, great! I'm frozen. As long as I have more armor than him, it removes it all. Ah. Uh. It's kind of weird that the, got, the knockdown was blocked, but I guess it's kind of like a worst case scenario thing. If Like, worst case, if a guy has no physical armor, you knock him down. Alright, so I have uh, Assassinate. Who should I Assassinate? 
Mm. Maybe this guy? I'm thinking that guy. Picky targets. I mean, anyone, at this point, anyone can be. Okay. And I guess I'll. Uh... Dude, he's almost dead. Yeah, I know he is. Now, he, now he's really dead. Alright, so I'm thinking of going here, right in front of him. Who, who gets their turn next? Oh, uh, the invisible guy does. Yeah, this big invisible guy. I do He's wanna, probably next I want to I want to arrow spray this guy on the beginning of my next turn, so it's a uh, tactical retreat right right beside him. And skip and end our turn. Show yourself. There he is. That's nice water iron Ned. <laughs> you just stunned. You get fucked. Uh what the fuck is this? Okay, so no matter what, it's gonna miss a bunch. Is there a guy up there? Nah, whatever. Uh, there is a guy that's knocked down. Whatever. Okay, and then adrenaline. And what else? Sky shot, I guess. Oh, he's almost dead. Uh, is there anything else here? Marksman's Fang. This is interesting. Can I hit that guy? The guy on the ground I was more concerned about. Nah, I don't think I can. Uh, oh, I can barrage him, actually. Well, yeah, Got I was going to say, I can't. <laughs> I get another turn. <laughs> It's just awkward now how there's like no music in this at all. Fucking whatever. Alright, uh, I don't know what to do now. A beautiful singing voice, Mike. Ricochet? No. <laughs> actually, that won't I bounce. Yeah, I, I, you can actually see it if it bounces, but yeah. I'm just trying to see here. Um, man, I guess I'll just do piercing damage to this guy. All right, we need like maybe let me try doing options. Mute this sound when the game is not focused. Now it's just this combat just doesn't have music in it. What the fuck? Fucking spin to win. Night's on fire. Deja vu. Elephant. Oh, we're all frozen. Uh, I can I can get one of you out of that. Why don't you just put a fireball in the middle of us? Fair. I did keep some fire some grenades for this exact moment. Yeah. Just fucking do it. We don't care. Glory Boop! There you go. Oh well, I'll just get myself out of that. Now, now we're wet. And I'm not to oh, what? <laughs> You're fucking still frozen. It looked like it was gonna be good, but right of it. It's my soulmate. Oh, fuck. Why don't I get soulmate? I say I get to be cursed. Oh, uh, I could bless the terrain just to make sure you don't have to worry about it. Actually, they, they both can get out of there, can't they? No, nah, yeah, we got fucking stuff for that. In which case, Farsight Infusion on my Incarnate, so we can actually do some stuff next turn. I, I, I assume and... you have the guy that's on the ground. I assume you, or he's not on the ground anymore. Yeah, yeah. And, um, fucking... Yeah, I don't know what to do, actually. Yeah, maybe Courage! <laughs> Fine, whatever! No, Sabiel, why? Sabiel's not human. <laughs> you take that back. Alright. Let's see how this works. Guardian Angel, the fuck? Oh, it's an aura. 50% of incoming damage is redirected to nearby ally. Oh, so you're taking the damage. Yeah. Holy shit, you mean you actually are going to be a tank? Yeah! Fucking A. Yeah. That guy goes next. I can't. I can set him up so you can deal with him, actually. Hey, eat shit. Oh, I don't. I don't. I don't know how much I'm gonna do here, but we'll see. Blitz attack. Ooh. Fuck! I can't blitz attack that. Why can't I see him? He's too far. I'm fucking for real. I can't battering ram either. What the fuck can I do? Guess I can fly. Cry. I'm gonna have to fly over there. Mine. 
I can all in him, I guess. Yeah, we'll all in this guy. I missed. <laughs> because I'm cursed. Oh well, we lost. Well, at least now he has to run away. Ah, uh, sucker. Need some damage. What an asshole. It's fine. Beast did his job. Beast is frozen. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? As long as you're standing next to him, he's taking half your damage. <laughs> hey, I'm good with that. Alright, so I took that. Alright, guess I'll just try and hit this guy. I doubt I'm gonna kill him this turn. I, I don't know why I still have reactive shot. Oh, he almost died. Actually, I probably should have just finished that guy off, but whatever. Because I would have gotten two free AP points for that. Oh, you got him. You sniped him. Your yeah, boy. Are you fucking for real? <laughs> yeah. You give that you shit back that shit to me right, right now. <laughs> Wait, he can't. He has magic armor. What an asshole. I'll take it from his corpse. It's fine. Frozen blood. Frozen blood? What does that even do? YOLO. Hey, blood totem. Frozen blood? Chance to knock down. I guess it's just like a water surface. It makes sense. Uh, fucking, I don't know. Just, just, whatever, just, stop wasting time. Alright, yeah, I'll fucking... Alright, I guess I'll just like... Oh, I wanted to onslaught him, actually. He's just outside of range. I wish I had like a free movement thing, like you know, like like the pawn. Like the pawn? Yeah, yeah. I wonder how you get the pawn. I don't know. I think it's impossible. Is there anything else here? Reactive Nobody's armor. Nobody's ever done that. Oh yeah, you gave me reactive armor. For some reason. Uh, is there anything else here that was kind of interesting? I guess that's it. I mean, it's an AoE ability that you might keep reactive. Use. Eat reactive armor. Yeah. It also hurts you, by the way. Yeah. Do you think I give a fuck? <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Even the sure. reflect damage. Even my reflect damage does more damage than you or something. Go. All right, incarnate. Very carefully. Don't step in the eyes. <laughs> Guardian angel. Oh yeah. Oh, I see how this works. Oh, I see. You have an aura around you. Yeah. That's kind of cool, actually. Okay, I'm going to step down on this perch. Probably lose my bonus. Because the really cool thing is... <laughs> <laughs> I knew! I fucking knew the moment I... Just, uh. Oh, man. So, Guardian Ninja, how, how much does that require? Does it require source points? No, it just... Fucking damn it! Doesn't? Guardian Angel... It's... Nope, just two action points. Last for two turns. Warfare three. That is actually really clutch because you can like go into like a situation where it's really bad and like fly into it, you know. Where have you gone? Oh, where's Sutter gone? Oh no. Uh, can I go to shopping now? Uh, yeah, I guess you can. I mean, we're, we. I think we're gonna end the episode now, anyways. All right, fine. I'll stay for the episode ending. Oh uh, well, well, let me identify all the shit here, and then we can just buy things after. It's okay. Send to Efan. Okay. Send to e Huge healing potion. I'll pick that up. Uh, telekinesis and critical chance on strength gloves. I don't need it, so I'll give it to Beast, I guess. But I don't think you have anything. Yeah. Uh... All right. So what happened to? So it says I met with Sada, Sada, the Red Princess, who made love, as to in in engender a new race of dragons. But afterwards, we were ambushed by a group of vile lizards. Their leader said Sada is. Uh, betrothed to another king, but how, who, who could that be? One thing is clear, these lizards do not belong to the House of Shadows. With no clue where to look for Seta, I'm at a loss. Okay, so she just disappeared, basically. Oh, dude, there's a pouch here, but it it counts as stealing? Very, very careful. Yeah, that's okay. Oh, it's, uh, it belongs to this guy down here, that's why. I guess we looted everything. So what do we get here? Challenge good look. I guess I'll learn that. Was there anything else you gave me? I don't think so. I gave you a helmet. I gave it a Sabeel. Okay. Ah, sweet. Uh, Intel Hente 13. So, Efan gets it. 
All right. You're damn right. Uh, no, I'm gonna treasure fucking Jahan's diary forever. All right. So for Prince's skills, um, so I just got him challenged. So is there something I don't use here? I mean, I don't know. A lot of this is really good. I don't use Heart of Steel up, but I like having it. We haven't used Skin Graft once. That's the thing. But I mean, I have Onslaught now, so it's actually worthwhile to use now. Battering Ram, Bloodsucker. I guess I don't use Bloodsucker. We're gonna retire it, actually. Yeah, you're my healer at this point. So yeah, I got plenty of healing skills on me. Uh, where is? Because every t every time I'm like, in I never want to heal myself. I always want to. You also have Necromancy as well, so you heal naturally by doing damage. Exactly. Yeah. So it's like I'm all the healing we need, really. So I, I'm I'm gonna put challenge on. All right, and then I'll probably reorganize this so that a lot of this is gonna be. Yeah, I'm gonna head back to town. Gonna be whatever. So yeah, we are done, guys. Oh, wait, no. For now. Uh, so thanks very much for tuning in, and uh, we'll. Uh, Resume next time. So take care, everyone. We'll reorganize, and as he'll keep buying stuff, and and I'll just whatever. Yeah, we'll um, give you a shopping list afterwards. Do, do, do you think? Do you think they're gonna fucking care if I just eat corpses here? I yeah, go for it. Oh, you That's know, a big may, yeah. Maybe I should have checked if. Uh, yeah, whatever. We'll just assume it was fine. I'm so sure we'll shame ping you in the comments. No, that one exploded big too, and there was nothing there, so it's fine. Ah, there's nothing left for you to eat, except for up here. You have to walk. <laughs> oh, you found it's one. Just, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you found a throat piercer. Alright. Alright, we're good then. Alright, peace out, guys. Peace out.